To begin the quest, head to the area located here on the map. Speak to Jones the Fisherman and choose the chat options on screen. Next, pickpocket the Master Fisherman near the Fishing Guild entrance. This may take several tries, but keep at it until you receive a sea chart. With the chart in your inventory, head back to Jones and he will take your sea chart. Then head back to the Master Fisherman, speak to him, and choose the first chat option. Next, exit the Fishing Guild, then head to the area located here on the map. Find, then speak to Linza. You'll get a cutscene. Next, head to the Tower of Life, just south of Arty. If you have access to the Kandarin Monastery Teleport, that is a quick option. Once there, speak to the guns. He is lifting a log and is shirtless. Then speak to Bonafido, just here east, and you'll receive some builder's tea. Now just to the east of the tower, you will find some white flowers. Go ahead and pick one. Then speak to the guns. Use the flower on the tea and choose the first chat option. You will now be teleported to the fishing guild. Before we continue, make sure to dismiss or send home any familiars that you might have. You are now ready to hunt the Thalassus. To start, speak to Jones and choose the first chat option. You will now have to track the big fish. Now, just like any sort of kebet hunting, select one area, then highlight another area to track it. It's no different here, except you have a limited amount of tries. But this is all a trial and error, as it'll always be the same result. So again, it's all trial and error. Now I'm simply just clicking on different ships in order to eventually I will run out of chances. But that's okay. Head back to your starting point, then click on the other ships that you know are part of the sequence. This will definitely take a few tries. Also, you'll notice these ships have a right click option to loot. You may do so. This is optional. So I'm not sure on what the loot is, but you could carry up to three pieces of loot.
and eventually through trial and error, you will find the beast. You will receive a cutscene. After the cutscene, you will land on a small island with mermaids. Speak to them and choose the chat options on screen. After the conversation, you will find yourself back on the ship. Now you'll need to hunt the monster once again, but unfortunately I think this is a different sequence, but the same rules apply, so trial and error. So feel free to pause the video and continue once you've hit the monster. Once you spot the monster once again, you will get a cutscene. With that out of the way, head back to Linza, just outside of the fishing guild once again. And for the last time, head back to Jones, where you started the quest. And quest complete.